I said this mountain bender when I addressed uh, the breakfast um, on the, the last Thursday we were here. There is a special bond, a special bond, and a unique bond with this delegation. And this is not something that is common in the United States Congress. We care about one another. We make sure that each other, when they're putting forth legislation, not as Chris Dodd told me, stealing it out of people's pocket as they walk to the floor, but helping them to succeed in this institution, not for self-aggrandizement, but for good public policy. And I would just tell you that we are going to be joined by Jim Hines. <laughs> to help make that happen. I'll say one quick thing, which I wasn't going to say, but I will. It is Jim's opponent who just yesterday said, when asked about Sarah Palin being on the ticket with John McCain, how that would fly in Connecticut. And he said that Connecticut voters will be happy just because there is a woman on the ticket. My friends, demeaning to women, insulting to women. When you deny, when you deny women the right to choose, to the real price. 
life of a third Bush term. for our children, and for our families. And we're going to seize that moment of that last night in Denver at Invesco Field. Bringing people together, giving them purpose, and we're going to work the phones, we're going to knock on the doors, we're going to help with the mailings, and we are going to bring real change to this country. The sign-up sheets are out there. The Hilltop Brigade is here to Take advantage of the opportunities that are out there. Add your name to a list today. Make a commitment to get out there and make a difference. The change that some 80,000 people cheered in Denver on that last night began with millions of individual acts of courage. Let us continue in these 60 days those individual acts of courage. Let us make opportunity real once more in this nation. Let people understand that they have an hour not an adversary in government, and that we can forge public policy once again, as we have historically in this nation, to change people's lives for the better, to make them economically secure, to make their families economically secure. Let's make history in November.